Hey guys, welcome to day 15, halfway mark, we made it. <laughs> um, my husband and I have both been kind of in and out of bed today, just not feeling too good, but God is still good. He's still working, he's still moving, he's still teaching and showing us and molding us, so we continue to move forward. Um, God has been doing some things in our lives, um, a lot of things that I've really, I've been like that kid who found out, you know, their brother or sister's Christmas gift, oh my God, I just want to tell them, I want to tell them, but the Lord is saying, no, let me, let me continue to put some things in place, and as those things get put into place, I'll release you to give your testimony, to let everyone know of my faithfulness, of my goodness, to give me the glory, and so in that my prayer for you today is that you take out time to really ask God for discernment as to not only when to speak about things that are going on in your life or about plans that are happening in your life, but to whom to speak to. I think it's really important that we are um, careful who we tell our plans to because the very people that smile in our face could be the very people that kind of sit in the background wishing for our demise who really... They, they want the best for us as long as we don't supersede them. And so I just really am trying to be careful. I have a very small group of people that um, I respect as intercessors that I do speak to. And I ask them to kind of stand in the gap with me, stand in agreement with me that the Lord will continue to guide my husband and myself in the decisions that we make. Because every little thing we do makes a difference. Every little thing we do affects our lives for the good or for the bad. And especially when you have children, four children, you, you want to make sure you make the right decision. You want to make sure you're staying within the will of God. So um, I just love you guys so much. I appreciate so many of you. We've had so many people um, reading the blog and watching the videos, not just from the U.S., but from the U.K., from um from Africa, from Ireland. So I'm, I'm just really humbled by what God is doing through this challenge. And I really pray that not only does God do a work within me and through me, but that he does so within each and every one of you that watches this video, that he, he will make such a change in, in your lives and our lives that people will see us and know that something's different. That not only will people see us and know that something's different, but that we'll look out and just see the world differently and make a difference and start that movement and be careful with our priorities and let go of everything and everyone that's irrelevant. And just, I mean, I'm just expecting so many great things from this. Just so you guys know, as I finish this up, when these 30 days finish, literally the next day after the 30 days, I will be speaking at a virtual women's conference. It is virtual and it is free. So I'm going to be sure when I post this video to add the information or the link for the information so that you can sign up. You can be a part of that. That's going to be amazing. I'm only one of four amazing speakers. So it's going to be great. And, um, and then, of course, after that is Thanksgiving. So what a way to bring in Thanksgiving with just a fresh perspective and, and a, a renewed mind and heart. So I love you guys. And let's just say a quick prayer. God, we thank you. We thank you for today. God, we thank you for waking us up, for bringing us life, giving us life and life more abundantly, God. God, we thank you that for, for the rest that my husband and I have been getting today and not feeling well. I speak healing over our lives on the top of our heads to the soles of our feet. God, we pray that you will give us a heightened discernment to know who to speak to and when to speak. You will help us to keep our mouth shut when we need to just keep things to ourselves. And you will help us to show us the right people to speak to that will pray with us and stand with us. We thank you for these things. And we thank you for everything you're doing and you're continuing to do in the process. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you guys. I'll see you tomorrow.